Hello, this is Daniel from soundheadquarters.com. First off, I want to thank you guys for the thousand subs. I really, really appreciate it. Let's keep it going. And here in this quick video, we are just doing a ceiling tile refresh. We're upholstering the ceiling tiles and we're also adding some HVAC deadening and some acoustic insulation above the tiles. Here's a little sneak peek at the finished product and let's get into it. So this stuff right here is mass loaded vinyl, which is faced with an, a fiberglass acoustic insulation. This is all fire rated, which was important for this uh, corporate job at the University of Toronto here. And there's a little close up shot of the mass loaded vinyl and the fiberglass acoustic insulation. And this stuff is meant to be wrapped with the acoustic insulation facing the HVAC pipe. So we're just gonna take down these ceiling tiles. These will all get upholstered. We'll show you that in a moment, but the first step is to wrap any available HVAC pipes. So this stuff just cuts to size. I'm just cutting the mass loaded vinyl part with an X-Acto knife and then just cutting the acoustic fiberglass insulation with my scissors. And now I can just wrap this around these circular pipes. So the flat, um, the flat sections of the HVAC where a lot of the machine noise was coming from, uh, just due to access above, we weren't able to actually wrap those sections. Um, so we just put flat sections of this material on top of the tiles afterwards, which we'll see. So there, there you can see that the circular tube has been wrapped and we are just using aluminum HVAC tape that keeps everything all fire rated. Um, otherwise you could just use duct tape if you don't need fire rating. Um, but that is how we are doing that. Here is the fabric. This is just a contrasting fabric of the podcast room that we did. Uh, you can check out my earlier videos if you want to see what we did in this room. And here's what I'm using to upholster these ceiling tiles. I'm just using 3M Super 77 spray adhesive and my pneumatic stapler. And I'm just spraying each ceiling tile uh, completely with that 3M Super 77 adhesive, laying it down and just stepping on it to make sure there's a lot of contact there, cutting the fabric, and then just wrapping over and stapling on the opposite side. And then I can just go in and trim off all the excess there. And it's okay to have some overhangs. This will all be above the ceiling tile tracks. And there is what it will look like after it is upholstered. And we are also going to be adding some acoustic insulation to the backside of these ceiling tiles just to add an additional layer of sound deadening for this office. They're experiencing a lot of machine noise um, in their office from all of the HVAC machinery right above them. So we're just getting an additional layer of acoustic insulation above them just to help deaden some of that noise. So this is Rockwell Comfort Board 80, and we we're just cutting this to size and I'm just using uh, PL construction adhesive uh, to adhere that acoustic insulation to the back side of the ceiling tile. So I just cut it a, a few inches shy of the border around the whole tile, glue that on, and once that's dry we can put that right back up into the ceiling. So just placing these tiles right back into the ceiling. And that one was for the spot on the right there. And there we go. And there's the first row of tiles upholstered. I put that vent back in place as well. And you can see it's a much nicer look and better acoustic performance with that acoustic insulation on the backside. And this thick fabric also offers at least a little bit of, of uh, deadening on the inside of the room as well. And you can see me putting just a flat section of that mass loaded vinyl with the acoustic insulation on top, just where the flat parts of the HVAC machinery is where we can't wrap it around that section, but we can just place it on top of the tiles just to get another layer of mass and density and just something to help stop that HVAC machinery noise from coming right down above uh, the workers' heads when they're in the office there. And that one there has the cutout for the sprinkler vent. This one previously had the camera. Um, so just working around, pretty simple. It's just a repetitive process. We're just doing the upholstery and doing the acoustic insulation on top, the rock wall on top, and then anywhere where we had that HVAC machinery, we were putting that mass loaded vinyl with the acoustic insulation on top. There is the last tile, just getting that put into place. And that is it for this quick video. Here's a finished look. A lot nicer of a look inside this office here, really helps uh, to kind of modernize the room and also they get better acoustic performance, less HVAC noise. And we have one more room to do here at the university. Stay tuned. Please subscribe, like, share. Thank you guys for watching this short one. This has been Daniel from Sound Headquarters. Peace out.